And to Katina, where the state government has completed arrangements to commence sales of grains at subsidized rates to residents. The state government earlier purchased grains worth 10 billion naira as part of measures to ensure food security. TVC News' Abdulatif Yusuf reports. The hardship faced by residents of Katsina are part of the growing national concern over the effects of economic reforms introduced by the federal government. Cost of commodities such as maize, millet and guinecon have risen beyond 70% due to inflation and insecurity. Most recently, the government inaugurated a tax force committee to promote food security and to check excesses of grain merchants who hold hundreds of tons to create artificial scarcity. Again, Governor Diko Radda is setting up another committee to reach out to 1.2 million vulnerable residents with free food and cash through the Ramadan period. The governor explained that the initiative will feed an estimated number of 72,200 people each day of the Ramadan. While for buyers, the government has subsidized the price of grains to 20,000 naira per bag, but an individual can only buy 10 measures at a time. We want to sell these grains to people that need it the most. The grains include maize, millet, and unicorn. And we are expecting that we sell this grain and we should devise means to avoid people that will be by the side and will be pushing money to the most vulnerable to buy for them. The essence of it is to reduce the prices in the market and also to allow the poor to be able to buy food at an affordable rate. Even though we have uh, the issue is just to cushion the effect, we are doing it in three forms. We are selling to the needy. We are providing palliatives free of charge to the most vulnerable people in the society. Governor Radha emphasized the importance of accountability in the distribution process, directing local government committees to remit proceeds from the grain sales to the state committee for deposit in government accounts. The other thing is very important month that is coming, the month of Ramadan. We as government will be able to do something to reduce the effect that it will have on the economic uh, problems that are affecting uh, the state and the country in general. The chairman of the Grains Distribution Committee, Marlon Khalil Musak Ofarbai, and other members reassured residents of the state their commitment to give the best in their assigned task. Abdul Latif Yusuf, TBC News, Kazana.